Please subscribe. Do remember if you wish to open a trading account, check out my Webull link below. You'll get some free stocks. Minimum deposit required is $100. Also, pre market hours trading starts at 4 a.m. sharp. 4 a.m. sharp with Webull. Webull only the way to go. Good morning, good morning, good morning, good morning, good morning, good morning, ladies and gentlemen, and welcome back to the channel. My name is Dave Natch. I speak stocks. Today is Fire Friday, December the 17th, and in today's video, I have one play for you and one to put on stock. But before I go into the plays, let me delve into yesterday's recap of the markets. The Dow Jones Industrial Average closed down 0.083% yesterday, sitting at 35,897, the Dow. The Nasdaq, they cratered... 2.47% at 15,180. Apple plunge 3.93% at $172.22. Um, the company will be closing some stores because of the outbreak of the new variant. Let's jump right into it. Dave's play today is a SP play in and out, grab and go, one and a move. GNFT. GNFT is up 50% in the pre thus far at 499. The higher day, 515. If this one retracts below 449, this might be a no go today. The company came up with news. There will be a partnership with Ipsen. Go ahead and read the news on your own time, your own term. This one is in the biotech space with very low volume. Watch for the volume to pick up today. Let's kick the tires. They were a market cap of 142 million. They have 43 million in the float, no insiders, okay? 1% of the float are held by institution insurance as a measly 0.02% of the float. Their revenue is 5.32 million. Their revenue per share is <laughs> 0 0.13, this is GNFT. Their gross profit is 8 million. Total cash in hand, 104 million, okay? Their total debt is 71 million. They have a current ratio of 3.92 GNFT. Please put on stock today. Mox C, M O X C. The stock is up 13% at 476. The company came out with news. Go ahead and read the news on your own time, your own term. That's all I have for you, ladies and gentlemen. Short video. I'll see you when I see you. And remember, always protect your neck, always set a stop loss. Do not invest more than you're willing to lose. And when you see some profits, take some profits because now you see them, now you don't. Enjoy your weekend. I'll see you on the next one. Dave Natch, I'm out. Boom, bam, make your next trade your best trade.
All right, thank you for watching. Dave Natch, I'm out. I speak stocks. Today is Tuesday, September the 29th. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Today, my Walmart is streaming. Well. Today's 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 well. Today's
When night came and he was released from the plow, his heart was bitter, and his legs were weary, and his neck was sore where the bow had chafed it. The farmer lingered in the barnyard to listen. The ox began first. You are my good friend. Because of your wise advice, I have enjoyed a day of rest. And I, retorted the ass, and like many another simple-hearted one who starts to help a friend and ends up by doing his task for him. Hereafter, you draw your own plow, for I did hear the master tell the slave to the butcher, were you sick again? I wish he would, for you are a lazy fellow. Thereafter, they spoke to each other no more. This ended their friendship. Canst thou tell the moral to this tale, Rodan? Tis a good tale, responded Rodan, but I see not the moral. I thought not that you would, but it is there and simple too. Just this. If you desire to help thy friend, do so in a way that will not bring thy friend's burdens upon thyself. I had not thought of that. It is a wise word. I wish not to assume the burdens of my sister's husband. But tell me, you lend to many. Do not the borrowers repay? Maython smiled the smile of one whose soul is rich with much experience. Could a loan be well made if the borrower cannot repay? Must not the lender be wise and judge carefully whether his gold can perform a useful purpose to the borrower and return to him once more? Or whether it will be wasted by one unable to use it wisely and leave him without his treasure and leave the borrower with a debt he cannot repay? I will show to you the tokens in my token chest, and let them tell me some of their stories. In his room, he brought a chest as long as his arm, covered with red pink skin and ornamented with bronze designs. So there you have it. Excerpts from The Richest Man in Babylon. Always remember, 10% of what you earn is yours to keep. Minimum 10% of every dollar you earn is yours to keep forever. <laughs>